Welcome to Chinta Statistics and Data Science. Today we are going to solve this problem from IIT JMMS 2022, problem number 15. The problem says that let the system of equations x plus ay plus z is equals to 1, 2x plus 4y plus z equals to minus b, and 3x plus y plus 2z equals to b plus 2 have infinitely many solutions where a and b are the real constants. Then the value of 2a plus 8b equals, there are four options. So this equation, this system of equation has infinitely many solutions where a and b are some real constants. Then the value of 2a plus 8b is, we are supposed to find the value of 2a plus 8b. Now, writing this entire equation in the matrix form, we have this thing, this matrix, this matrix of coefficients, this 1, a, 1, 2, 4, 1, and 3, 1, 2. And this, this being the matrix of the, this being the vector of unknowns, and this being the vector of the RHS, right? So this entire thing can be written as a into x vector into b vector, right? This entire thing. Now, it has got infinitely many solutions. For infinitely many solutions, rank of a must be equal. This this entire condition should hold. Rank of a is equal to rank of a augmented b. This this notation means a augmented b. This this the rank of a should equal to the rank of a augmented b. And this entire thing should be less than three. Where three is basically where did we get get the three? Here three means the number of columns. Here the matrix has three columns, right? One, two, three. So number of it should be less than the number of columns. Here number of columns is three. So this entire thing rank of a equals to rank of a augmented b is less than three. This thing should hold for infinitely many solutions. Now it has got infinitely many solutions, right? It has already been told. That means this must be true. This must be true. So reducing the matrix a augmented b to echelon form, we get this matrix. This is the initial matrix a augmented b. Just adjoining the, the RHS vector, the vector in the RHS as the fourth column in the matrix a. This entire matrix is a augmented b. So upon performing these two operations, this, you know, my adding minus two times the row one to the row two, and again adding minus three times the row one to the row three, we get this thing, this entire thing. Just converting it to echelon form. Basically, we are just sweeping out the first column using the first element as the pivot. We don't actually need to convert it wholly into the echelon form because even before doing that, we can easily solve the problem. So just doing these these two operations, this first operation and second op um, row operation, these two operations, we get this matrix reduces to this one, right? So just focus on, first. firstly, just focus on this part, this A part, this is, this is A, this part, this part, this is A, right? This is just A. So rank of A should be less than three, right? That means these two rows must be equal, right? Or say, you know, these two these two vectors should be a linear multi uh, scalar multiple of one another, right? Now, obviously, this 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 uh, corresponding elements are the same, zero and zero, and minus one and minus one, right? These two, zero is equals to zero, and minus one. These are same. The, the corresponding first and third components are same, right? Therefore, this component and this component must be same, so that the entire row, this second row and this third row becomes the same ultimately. So that means rank of a is equals to two, even only if 4 minus 2a is equal to 1 minus 3a. That means these two, 4 minus 2a and 1 minus 3a, these two are same. That means ultimately a becomes minus 3, right? A becomes minus 3. That means a, if a is equal to minus 3, then rank of a is 2, right? Rank of this, this matrix, this particular matrix has rank 2, fine. Again, rank of a augmented b, that means this entire matrix, rank of a augmented b is equal to 2 if and only if, along with a being minus 3, b, this thing. This, this entire row should be same, this this row and this row, this second row and third row of the entire matrix, not the, just the matrix A, this entire matrix A augmented B. So this row and this row must be same. same. So obviously, this these two things, this 4 minus 2A and 1 minus 3A, get equal if A is equals to minus 3, right? A equals to minus 3. And these two, minus B minus 2 and B minus 1, is e, are, are the same value if B is equals to minus half. That means for a equals to minus 3, we have rank of A is equals to 2. And for A equals to minus 3, along with B equals to minus half, we get rank of A augmented B equals to 2. That means in that case, both are the same ranks, right? Rank of A and rank of A augmented both are same, which is equal to 2, which is in turn is less than 3, right? That means we have fulfilled the condition, right? We have fulfilled the condition. That means this entire condition is fulfilled 
if and only if a equals to minus 3 and b equals to minus half. Now, obviously, 2a plus 8b is nothing but minus 10, putting in the values of a and b. That means the ultimate answer is minus 10. It's a very easy problem. Just We just needed to know the condition of this thing. For infinitely many solutions, we have rank of a equals to rank of a augmented b less than the number of columns in the coefficient matrix. That's it. That's it. So do like, share, and subscribe to the channel for more exciting problems. See you till next time.